Hi, Aaron here from Superior Singing Method, and this is How to Sing Well Exercises. Okay, how to sing well exercises. I'm gonna give you uh, one of my favorite exercises at the end of this video, but first I just wanna give you a little bit of an, an, an analogy to explain why vocal exercises are so important. Because a lot of my students will be like, what, what's, how do we, how do these things correlate? I wanna sing songs, I don't wanna sing scales, I don't wanna sing, what does mom, 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 mom have to do with singing the song? I wanna sing songs, help me with that. So I wanna give you a little bit of an analogy. If you've seen The Karate Kid, there's one from the 80s, that was actually much better than the more recent one with, um, I don't know, Jaden Smith or whatever. Uh, but there's a great analogy in there. And uh, he, so he, the, his, his sensei is having him take on the, put on the jacket, take off the jacket, put it on the floor, hang it up, put on the jacket, take off the jacket, put it on the floor, hang it up. It's like over and over and over again for hours. And he's like, this is stupid. Like, why am I doing this? Yeah, I want to learn Kung Fu or whatever. So he does it for hours and hours and hours. And then, of course, um, the kid's like, oh, I'm out of here. And then I'm not doing this anymore. And the sensei says, hey, come back over here. And then he throws a punch at him. And he's like, um, put on the jacket. And he's like, Take off the jacket. And he, all of a sudden, like, now he knows Kung Fu. It's a little bit ridiculous. And all of a sudden, he's like, but what the point of it is that the repetitive motions that we do over and over again, they're building up muscles and we're getting good at something else that we don't even realize. We're actually training the voice to be more, these repetitive movements help train the voice to be more automatic. These automatic patterns of movement teach us how to um, get our voice and place our voice and our throat and get everything to where it needs to be uh, when we do sing. So we do these over and over and they feel stupid and boring and whatever, but then when we go to sing, all of a sudden it's like, ah! like how can I do it? What happened? I couldn't sing before. So anyway, that's the point of, of exercise that manipulates the vocal tract, builds the muscles in the vocal, uh, vocal tract, and you become better without even realizing it. So I, I want to give you actually two exercises. Uh, one is kind of for the morning and one is uh, for, for any time. The morning is, I uh, talk about this in some of my videos, it's always closed mouth stuff. So some hums, what I'll do is I'll start out low, I'll be like, hmm, hmm. Just start in like a nice comfortable range and do that you know, several times and then a little higher. Mm -hmm. See, I'm getting a little bit of nose in there. Uh, the Italians say, you know, don't sing through your nose, but put a little nose in it. Mm -hmm. Helps keep nice closure in your vocal cords. Mm -hmm. Up a little higher. And then actually my favorite vocal exercise that I do all the time if I just want to get, get my voice ready for something is, you may have seen it before, but it's lip rolls. It's... And you can just kind of slide up and down the scale for a while, and that's really good for your voice. It's a nice warm up, and you can't harm your voice by doing that. So it's a great way to kind of warm up, but it's also a great way for, as an intermediate exercise too, right before you sing. Okay, so I hope that's helpful. Click the link below, get my favorite vocal exercise, some other fun free stuff, and you can find my course, Superior Singing Method, down there. It's an eight week systematic program where I teach you everything you need to know about your voice from A to Z to give you that, you know, the power and the range and every, everything that you want. Also, leave me a comment. Uh, a lot of the, what I do, a lot of content I do comes from my comments of what you want to hear. So, um, and last, finally, I say in a lot of my videos, believe in your bigness. There's more in you than you realize. Don't give up. You're more powerful than you think you are. So keep pushing forward. It's the tenacious, the people who keep moving forward and moving forward that really make it in this business. So don't give up. Okay. Hope you're well. Bye-bye.